The 18th of May was a big day for SnowRunner. It released on Switch. It released on Game Pass. It released on Steam. They announced Year 2. And they launched Phase 4. <laughs> a lot happened. But I thought it would be really cool to check out SnowRunner um, on the Switch. So that is what we're doing. I've been playing mostly on PC. But this is a very different device. A very different system. How does it look? How does it run? Well, let's find out. That's what we're going to do. Hopefully you guys are excited. I would love to play this game, by the way, on the move. In my car, as a passenger, on a train, on a plane, potentially in the future. This would be a great game for a flight. Oh, I'm hoping they eventually introduce crossplay, which I believe is happening between Steam and Epic Games, the Epic Games Store. Hopefully between consoles, between PC, crossplay, cross save, that sort of stuff. That'd be incredible. I would love that. It looks a little bit pixely for me because I'm playing on a 4K screen, which is not... Oh, wow. Okay, this looks very different. <laughs> this looks very different to the PC intro screen. All right. Especially that satellite. There's a lot of um, anti-aliasing on the very thin bits of metal. Interesting. All right. I mean, it is a Switch. I can't really compare it to my PC. That's not fair in any way. All right, we're going to begin... A brand new game. I remember doing this for the first time. My part one, my original part one, has 1.6 million views, which is just crazy. That boggles the mind. Um, turn that off. Um, in terms of audio, turn the music down. I've always been scared of the old music claims and stuff like that, so I just turn that off. It's not worth it. And begin a new game. Uh, I am playing with the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. No, I'm not doing hard mode on a Switch. <laughs> don't, don't. Don't. That's not even funny. I still feel like Michigan was probably my favourite map. I really did enjoy those, those first few episodes. I really did. Right. Uh, first, you need to find the Watchtower. To get a general view of the area. Okay, got it. Where's the X button on this? There you go. <laughs> oh, the memories. The memories. Okay, cool. Right, we are able to sit up for it. Yep. Here we go. Oh, man, the memories. Why is my four-wheel drive not on? Come on, man. I don't even turn it on. If not on this truck. Uh, there we go. All-wheel drive is on. Yes. Yes, it's not as good as the PC version, of course. But still looks pretty good, I think. Still looks pretty good. Right, first. The very first watchtower in the game. This is how everybody starts the game. Uh, this is if you're doing a career sort of thingy. This is how you play. Also, there's been no word about mods on the Switch, which I guess does make sense. Uh, they may add them, they may not. You do get mods on the Xbox, the PS4, the PC, of course. Where's this watchtower? There's a bit of popping. Definitely a bit of popping. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. Let's go. This brings back so many memories, it's crazy. So many memories. I was so... I wasn't sure what to expect, really. I just had this game on my radar, and I was very... Yeah, I just... I wanted to play it so badly. I had no experience with Mudrunner, Spin Tires, anything like that. It was... This was my first experience. It was quite daunting. Uh, you encounter different kinds of terrain. Yes. <laughs> I can confirm that is very, very... Very true. Dirt, mud, deep mud, water, rocky slides, snow, and ice. Yeah, there is a, a lot of terrain in this game. You really have to adapt to driving as well. You really have to adapt to it. See that? Like that way is blocked. So we're going to go around it. I don't remember if we actually ever fixed that. It's like a massive dip in the road. So we take alternative routes. The water... Doesn't look too bad. It looks a bit flat, a bit lifeless maybe. 
Oh, got a bit deep there. Yeah, this is your first vehicle in the game. Oh man, this is so awesome. The game has been out a year now and it's been such a such a pleasure to play. Such a good game. I can't wait to see what to do next. Uh, in terms of the different phases, of course. Refueling! Is that a watchtower over there? Yeah. Right, let's fuel up! It's not even that bad, really. Um, there we go. It's, 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 still it's still frozen up, actually, the old switch buttons. I think we're going that way. To the first watchtower. Oh, yeah. Should get through here, okay. Ooh, that's quite deep. So once it gets to a dangerous level, it will damage the engine, basically. Um, you see the engine's health drop, and if it floods, the engine just stops, and that's it. <laughs> Game over. <laughs> Not really. Not exactly. Oh, yes. Yep, that is a watchtower ahead. Yeah, I, think, I, I do think Michigan was my favourite map so far. I just, I loved it. I loved it. Right, so we need to try and find a truck capable of transporting materials that are needed to repair the bridge. Alright, call it. Should we have a little look at the uh, the launch site? The uh, the watchtower? <laughs> it's not a launch site. Sorry, I'm used to rockets recently. With SnowRunner. Right, map. Okay, we can look at the map. There we go. So where are we going? Okay, that's the truck we need. Got it. Um, you can put down navigation points. Um, there we go. Shouldn't be too hard. That is our first truck in the game. So what bridge do we need to fix to get to the garage? Oh, it's this one, isn't it? Yeah. I remember now. I remember. Right, let's go. We've got a big job to do. This is a big bridge. If we don't do this bridge, the rest of the game is in doubt. <laughs> it may not happen. Oh, but that's steep. Whoa. Hello. Yeah, uh, overall, I'm I'm pretty impressed. Considering what the Switch is like, the, the power of the Switch, the, fa the fact I can play this game now in portable form is incredible. I I'm so going to do that. That's why I bought it, to be honest. I remember playing this first episode thinking, oh, this game isn't too bad. I was warned. <laughs> I was warned. Enter phase four. You guys have been seeing my latest videos where I struggle. <laughs> struggle big time. Thick, soggy, deep mud. Icy conditions. It's the same driver as well. He must love his trucks and his cars, that's for sure. And there... Is our first truck. There we go. Not bad. You see it activates. There we go. GMC. Right, so we need metal beams. We're going to activate this as well. And two wooden planks. That is doable. Uh, first, we need the, the metal beams. Okay, we can do that. That's fine. Um, so we're going to go left out of here. Go into town. Go to town storage. You can see... There's another watchtower there. There's also an upgrade I can grab, which I probably should have done already, but I didn't. Whoops. All right, let's leave that. All right, that should now be activated. Let's go to the town. Pick up those metal beams. We've got uh, a little, little bed at the back there, which has got two slots available, so that's fine for metal beams. And wooden planks is one slot, so it'll be two deliveries to get this bridge done. Uh, this truck does not have four-wheel drive, all-wheel drive, diff lock, none of that. It's a very basic truck. It's what you start out in, so it's fine. And it's not, the conditions aren't too bad. Aren't too bad. So this truck is... I can't remember if I still have this truck. Or did I sell it? I must have sold it, surely. Yeah, there's a fair amount. You can see when I'm traveling through fairly quickly. There is 
quite a lot of popping. It's almost like the, the grass sort of randomly grows in front of you. Which may bother some people. Um, it's not ideal, I guess. But again, it's that CPU, the GPU in the Switch isn't as powerful as you may like. But hopefully they release uh, the Pro at some point, which I've been hearing about. Nintendo Switch Pro, which would definitely suit this game. So hopefully they come out with a patch or something like that. Yeah, the shadows are pretty poor quality as well. The fact I'm playing this on a 4K screen is not helping me at all. <laughs> it actually probably doesn't look as bad on the video, to be honest. Why the camera did that for? Right, anyway, our first pickup. Woo! Is that a trailer there? Does that have wooden planks on? No, I don't think so. Let's confirm if the, uh, the horn works. Yep, it does. Oh, cockpit view. One thing I love about this game is the sounds as well. The sounds are incredible. The engine, the little ricketties of the cargo. It's just a good sounding game and that's obviously all there in the, uh, the switch version of course right so the first job is almost done we have to get to the bridge and deliver all the goods deliver the metal beams this bridge is going to be essential for michigan and for our future endeavors so uh yeah let's try and get it done uh, while i'm here i will fuel up pretty please there we go a little fuel stop. Tempted to go straight here. Uh, I might regret this. <laughs> I might regret this indeed. Oh well. Screw it. Well, there we go. At least I get stuck. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I feared that bit for ages. I feared it for ages. Finally, just went straight for it. It's not even that bad, actually. It's really not that bad at all. Slightly deep water. I'm guessing this uh, truck does not have a snorkel. It's not really meant for off-road. One thing I've heard about that's quite exciting is Phase 5 might be more to do with highways. It actually makes me really excited. I'm, I'm really down for that, actually. Anyway, uh, let's deliver the metal beams. Uh, and by the way, you can get all the seasons, all the DLC that's out already. You can do that right now um, with the Nintendo Switch version. It's all there. Deliver the cargo. Boom. Part one done. And this bridge will lead towards our very first grad garage. Yes. And then we need uh, metal, not metal planks, wooden planks. That's what I'm trying to say. Let's go. Need two. Get it dawn. Oh yeah. Cockpit view as well is of course in the game. Surprisingly detailed. And it's got hands. I know. So many games. Breakfast. Uh, decide they want to just avoid hands altogether. Too much work. I ain't got time for that. I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly there is a there is an off-road route um, to the lumber mill. I think I might do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to risk it. Yep. Please don't get stuck. Please. That'd be super duper embarrassing. I don't want that. We should be alright. It's fairly... Well, this bit's quite muddy, actually. I'll take that back. Please don't get stuck. Again, no diff lock. No all-wheel drive. This is the normal truck. <sighs> What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, let me know if you guys are tempted to buy the game on Switch. Uh, did you guys know it released on Switch? Let me know. Uh, the big thing for me is it being on Game Pass. That That's a big deal for Xbox owners. In fact, you can just play it now, randomly. Uh, the only thing I would say is if the, if the, if the deal's a year, and then randomly the game just disappears. That could be annoying. Um, that's, that's the only negative, I guess. Normally the deals they have with Game Pass last a year, basically. Right, how do we pick up 
the lumber we need. Could just use that trailer. Um, or I could just enter the meal and just grab it. See what happens. If there's any issue I have, it might be a bit muddy in here. We may get stuck. Yeah. It might be alright. <laughs> he says. Please don't get stuck. Please. What I'm going to do is get edge myself in and then just roll back out, basically. Yep, yeah, just load it up for me, please. No. There we go. Auto load in. Love it. <laughs> we don't have a crane, so there's no point in doing manual loads right now. Yep, yeah, that's what we need. The wooden planks. We are good to leave now and head back. I remember this being so so daunting the first time I did it. Every bit of mud or a little lump in the road, I'll be like, ah! It's the panic. Absolutely panicked. I, I don't know how long I've played it for now. I think it must be at 50 hours now, honestly, which is quite a long time for me, actually. It may not sound long for some people, but for me, I tend to want it. I tend to want the, the sort of next experience, if that makes sense. I tend, to, I tend to want new things. Bouncy, bouncy. Love the horns in this game. Yeah, I downloaded the um, free content, but this is just literally the base version. Splash! Here comes Scully. Cool. I'm guessing there's probably mods to change the appearance of the driver. I've never looked, actually. Never installed any mods on this game, which I know is blasphemy. People love mods on this game, that's for sure. It is a big loss for the Switch version. Hopefully it's added in later on. And there should be the bridge done. Yay! Job done. First job done on the Switch version. Yes. Not bad, not bad. Deliver. That's it. Cargo bridge is done. That's a good looking bridge as well. I remember at this point, I was like, wow. <laughs> I'm hooked. I am hooked. Let me keep playing, basically. Uh, next objective is to find the garage. And at the, at the start, it is quite driven what you do. You sort of set on a direct path, I guess. Um, but as you progress, you can sort of do what you want, really. Uh, the garage is over here. I don't know if we can get there in this. I'm sure we, we can give it a go. We get stuck, we get stuck. What, what, what can you do? Might as well give it a go. I think that will be where we conclude this uh, this switch version for now. See garage there? Gas on the left. I'm pretty sure there's a roadblock up there. I might be wrong. And garage this way. We've got enough fuel as well. Plenty of fuel. I can't remember how bad it gets. <laughs> hmm. Fairly bad here. Just try and hit it with confidence. Try and find the grip. One thing I am struggling with, a little bit especially with this, I must admit it doesn't look as bad on the recording, but it's really hard to sort of pinpoint where the mud is. Again, I think I'm going to blame my screen on that. So the recording doesn't look as bad. What my TV is trying to do is basically... Uh, the resolution of the switch is trying to times it by four to make it fit on my screen And obviously that it's not great <laughs> it's, it's, It doesn't look great So far so good I know the farm here on the left gets very very muddy Very careful with that. I remember getting stuck there a few times 
actually we're doing all right we're doing all right oh okay hmm will we get stuck here ah okay this might be the toughest point we're so close as well oh we're so close can we get through it uh oh Okay, it's quite shallow. Woo! We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. It's not face force, Scott, it's fine. Don't panic. Should probably try and turn my lights on. No, I just killed the engine. I literally just turned the engine off. Did I do that? <laughs> I'm trying to turn the lights on, but. Oh, they are coming on. There we go. It's getting a bit late. This! is the very first garage and we have arrived we've made it a bunch of trailers over there as well which are very useful another truck is here beautiful what's this get upgrade is it a oh the fleet star and we've got an upgrade as well engageable all-wheel drive beautiful yes i'm pretty sure we can just switch to this fleet star that's outside. Oh, yes. I remember all these trailers were so daunting as well the first time. I had absolutely no idea what was going on. <laughs> there we go. Nice. I've got a diff lock. Oh. It's only available in local. Okay, yeah, of course. But it's got a diff lock, though. It's got a diff lock. That's not bad, is it? Oh, it's broke. So I need to recover it. Okay, I didn't, didn't realise. There we go. Luckily, it's right to the garage and you can just go straight back. It's fine. Um, and then I'm guessing... It's got engageable diff. Nice. And we have engageable all-wheel drive. The Fleet Star is here to play. That's for sure. Uh, and then you can see as you level up, things start to unlock as well. You can find stuff in the open world. The game, if you haven't played it, Highly recommend it. It's so much fun. I love it a bit. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing this on the Switch. And I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.